Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back. So I'm finally in Canada now and this is my first um, Lineage Red Knights video while I'm here. Um, as you can see, this is a new scene. Um, just going through this again because I, you know, this is the third time I said it. I said it once in an update video. I said it once in my um, Monster Super League video and I, this is the third time saying it for my Lineage video because I, I know a lot, like not everyone watches everything. So, um, but basically I'm in Canada now and this is just a temporary scene that I set up while I'm here. I'm only going to be here for two weeks. And after two weeks, I'm going back to Taiwan, and quality will be as good as usual. Um, but the quality is kind of pretty shitty right now. I didn't do any of my dailies today, but I'm gonna do them all right now, and I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna wing it. All right, I'm just gonna make sure I I do everything. So let's start with the summon. Um, I think it's always really exciting to, to do the summon every single day. Something useful. Garbage. Wait, is this a Kurtz? Actually, wait, this is good. This is actually good. Because uh, there's a curse event going on, and I can actually... Maybe I can get him to 4 stars. Like, if I if I get really lucky and do it every single day, maybe I can get him to 4 stars. But maybe I'm just getting hopeful here. But, um, still really nice. He's a he's a de decent monster. Like, I think... Um, might, might as well talk about it here right now. Like, because he's, he's going to be available to a lot of people. Um... I, I think he's one of the best tanks in the game, to be honest. Um, he has, he basically, uh, he has a self-heal on his first skill. That's based on physical damage. So if you have, like, da damage buff and stuff, it means he's going to be healing for more. Um, his, or or if you have, like, I think if you have armor break and he does more damage, then maybe he'll, he'll also heal more as well. Um, so, you know, any tank with self-sustain is definitely really, really strong. I think all the best tanks in the game probably have self-sustain self-sustain uh his second skill puts like a physical damage debuff on the enemy this is really useful and it's for three enemies so he not only sustains himself he also makes the enemy hit uh on his heart and what this thing activates when he uh, his HP drops below 30 percent he reduces 80 percent of incoming um damage and it lasts four seconds so it's kind of like adele's first move but um it's not an active it's a passive that will it's guaranteed to activate um, every single time as as soon as his HP drops below 30%. So, uh, you know, just looking at his, his skill set alone, you, you could probably tell he's definitely uh, really, really strong as a tank monster. Um, he's also natural 3 star, so, you know, natural 3 stars are pretty good, have pretty good skills. Uh, it's not always true. I don't think it's necessarily true for lineage. Uh, a lot of, like, 2 stars are better than 3 stars in this game. Like that bunny girl, she's like OP as hell. Um, but we're gonna we're gonna do what I what, start with the arena battle. Uh, they actually already ranked me today. I'm recording this super super late in the day because I uh, actually just finally got everything set up and finally was able to start recording. But um, basically, arena already ended like for today, but the day hasn't reset yet. So I basically um, already got my rewards for today. And nobody hit me. I, I stayed at rank 93 for for the whole entire day, for the whole entire uh, few hours that I was here. And we're gonna we're gonna try some comps. Oh oh oh! Wait 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 wait. Um, I forgot to tell you guys. I, I got my Zenith Queen. Um, I got all 20 pieces of her yesterday while I was on the air. Well, actually not on the plane, but I was at uh what I, after I got off the airport. Um, oh, was it before I got off the airport? I can't I can't remember. Um. No, it, it was well. It was before I left my house. Yes, because I I made a I made a post on on my Discord. Um, but I got her to thirty pieces, and um, she's my new my new anti magic um, monster. She's so fucking strong. Like you guys have no idea. Uh, let me. But she's only strong in some comps. Wait, this guy's top fifty, and he's really really strong. Let's see if I can. If I can use this comp to counter him, because Zenith Queen counters this comp so hard. Like this is the, this is the full magic comp. Like this is one of the, one of the meta comps um, right now. You'll you'll see this quite a lot. This is one of the meta comps. This guy's top 50. I'm not sure if I can beat him. If he's just gonna overpower me, but I, I wanna I wanna see if I can I can do something to him with my Zenith Queen. Oh shit! I'm taking too much damage. Heal, oh god, heal, oh god, heal, oh god, oh god, heal before he, she dies. Please, I need her to silence. I need her to put her silence, and then you can die. Please, 
Ah, oh, shit, she didn't silence. Damn it. It kind of fucked up, alright. That, that didn't work the way I wanted it to. Uh, maybe his monsters are just too strong. I think he's just too strong. Like, he had the... His, uh... His... His hero had the set too. I'll do another fight later. Like I'll find someone that is like has doesn't have like a full team of like four stars and and epic monsters. Um, and and I'll I'll show you like how she can basically silence and stop them from healing and stuff. Uh, what what was I gonna do? Oh yeah, I was gonna do the do the I was supposed to do a raid. Let's do a raid and also a, the time rift. Oh, is it Owen Day? It's Owen Day, isn't it? Yes, it's Owen Day. All right, let's uh try to get as many pieces as possible. Right, I can probably beat her at this level, this difficulty this time. I mean, I do have access to um I have access to a lot of strong monsters. Double healer, her, and then her. Oh shit, a lot of my main monsters aren't usable. I don't know if I can do this. I don't know if I can actually kill her. Hopefully I can kill her. Alright, I'm gonna I'm a pop the CC buff first. Actually, she doesn't have any CC. Just, let me just pop, pop, pop the resist and pop the damage buff. I can definitely beat her. If I can if I can keep that silence up. Also reduce attack speed is really strong too. Oh man, I think my Lara might die. She actually might actually die before before anyone else does. That would be really bad. I need to silence her before she AoEs again. Oh shit. Couldn't do so much damage. Alright, never mind. My, my bunny is really strong. My bunny is... Her, she's healing for so much. I, I love the new event. I actually got her to 4 stars because of it. Alright. That was, that was pretty good. Oh, nice. I got two pieces. I think I can upgrade Owen today. <coughs> oh, man. Um, excuse me. I'm still still sick as all hell. To be honest, I'm, I'm still... Actually, wait. Why should I... Why, why do I always have to say to be honest? I, there's nothing to lie about. I'm, I'm just sick. I'm just really... really... Um... I don't know. Maybe maybe rest a little bit more before I before I start spamming content again. Um, but I'll be on Discord. Like if you guys want to come talk to me, I'm I'll be on the Discord uh, channel and stuff. Um, the links below, and then you guys can uh, if you have any questions or anything, you can ask. I can I can basically reply to you in real time. You know, I'm chilling here. Uh, uh, get some food later, and the uh, yeah probably. Probably just do what I usually do. Just probably go back to sleep or something like that. Afterwards, um, rest up a bit so I can I can keep to keep working hard. Got to pop Owen just now. Oh, I also got the other guy, like Zeline, the other archer. I tried him for like one day, and he sucked balls. He was so fucking weak. I Owen's just so much better. Like. Um, the other guy has armor break, and armor break only affects physical units. Owen has like physical attack buff, but also crit buff. Although the physical attack buff doesn't affect anyone, the the crit buff does. So like crit buff basically buffs your whole entire team. So that's why Owen is like a better support monster um, overall. Nice, I have three. Wait, 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 let's do an extra run. I always do one extra run on, on Owen day because she's my main. Uh, you should definitely do this on your main. It only costs 70, 70 uh, diamonds. 
You can do one extra run for 70 diamonds. Possible to do the next difficulty. I have to be level 46 to do that one. Alright, let's see if I can get a ring, because I actually need a ring if I want to do the next um, upgrade. But I think I can do the level 2 upgrade now. Maybe I should wait till my Lara uses her nukes, and then right after she uses her nukes, I pop my uh, transformation. That be a good idea? Like, she uses her nu nukes, her first skill, and then wait for her to use her second skill. Like, right now, and it's like high single target damage, and then I transform crit buff, and then Owen ha has her, uh, has her ulti up right right then, and then I hit her for really hard. That might be a better way to, to use it. I think um, transformation is one of the only, like, Literally one of the only things you can do to, um, like, like, only mechanical things you can do in this game. Because it's basically all on auto. It's probably, like, even better to set most of your monsters on auto because they use their skills faster. If you manual, you actually might click slower, you know, so, um, this is, like, one of the games where, like, it's probably better on auto. Like, your monsters are probably better on auto. But the... The time, the timing that you pop the transformation is kind of the, like really, really crucial. It, it's it makes, um, it makes it so you can actually clear certain stages that you normally wouldn't be able to clear, um, even like when you're progressing through story mode and stuff. My voice is dying. Um, this this mic is even further from me, so I kind of feel like I need to talk a bit louder. But I maybe just bring it a little bit closer. Um, oh yeah, I, I got my. Transformation upgrade. Alright. Plus one. Uh, I just need eight more and a ring. Just basically eight more and a ring, and then you can plus two, plus three, plus four. Maybe in the future it'll increase. Um, but right now this is this is pretty good. So I have Owen at level two now, so she's definitely gonna be stronger. Um, definitely gonna be a lot stronger in the arena later. Alright, so uh, let's let's do our tower. Um, I'm not actually quite sure what I should do in the tower now. I think I want to farm for the vampire. I actually really do want to farm for the vampire. Oh wait, I, I do think there's a there's a destiny for one of my monsters. Clear one of the towers. Um, yes, he needs to clear floor 40. I'm not exactly sure if I can beat him. Alright, I still need like one more day to complete Full Moon Temple. Sure. But at least none of my main teams need anything for the tower. Alright, let's let's just not do that, Destiny. Like, I should do it. I don't know. I didn't do it five times or ten times. Actually, quite a lot. If I'm not aiming to get the zombie, then I, I mean in the future I definitely want to. But I think for now I, I wanna, I wanna try to get the vampire. It's gonna take me like a few more weeks as well. And at the same time I can farm some gear on the on these stages. Which one has a uh, better gear? This is probably for uh, Vashu. Like some epic chess chess piece I can use for Lara, that'd be perfect. Demon Hunter Ring. Well, I do have the Purified Ring, but I think this is for this is a crafting material for something else. All right, let's just let's just go higher. Let's just go higher. Um. Yeah, let's let's just go to this stage, and then I mean. Wait, does it all have a chance to drop blue coins? Every stage has a chance to drop blue coins, right? Alright, so I guess it doesn't matter. Let's just let's just go. Unable to enter Oh shit, I need to I need to clear my way up. Kinda sucks. 
Wait, does that mean I can't go to the boss floor? Even if he spawns? I'm on 23, right? No, I'm on 24. Alright, uh, let's go with... Let's go with, uh... Should I go with fast clear? Let's go with fa fast clear. I don't think I need to sustain for this. Probably be ideal to run two healers, but fuck it. I'm strong enough for this. I'm a strong, independent black woman. Boston spawn. I'm I'm just really curious to see uh if if the boss spawns, if I can do it. If I can go to his floor and, and kill him. If I can't, it's gonna be really sad. I'm gonna try to head all the way up to floor thirty. I should be popping my transformation every single time. I think the boss spawned. Yeah, he, he came out. Alright, let's see if we can go to his floor. I I legit think the vampire is going to be, like, probably the strongest tank in the game. Like, once people get him, he's going to be meta. I really think he's going to be meta. His, his skill set's insane. Ah, oh, fuck, I can't... I can't go to his floor! Wait, is my... Wait, I can do... I was at 25, right? 26, 27, 28, 29, and then I can do him once, alright? Uh, so, let's keep going, let's keep going. Wait, did I just do 25? Did I not do 25 yet? Oh wait, I'm at 26. Oh, I should have used a lot of my extra, extra, um, extra tries to progress. It would really suck for me to like do floor 30, have the boss spawn and I can't do him. So yeah, if you have like a only one ticket left at the end of the day, always use it to progress because you never know, you might need to farm the next um, next uh, tower boss like sometime in the future. Wait, did I just clear 20? Five or did I clear 26? Yeah, I can get to 27. I want to build like a a comp that like just aims for the back line. It's gonna be like the anti, uh... I think it's gonna counter the double healer comps. Although I do kind of have something that counters it. I don't think the Zenith Queen counters the, um... Uh, what's his, his name? Ba Baphomet? Like the, 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 the goat looking guy? Um, but he counters, a, she counters Adele. Like if you have Adele on the enemy team, you actually silence Adele and she can't heal. But you can't silence, um, you can't silence the goat dude because he... His second skill is like not a not a actual skill. It's not an active skill. It's just uh just a random skill. I click next floor, it doesn't go to the next floor. It's like trying to screw me over somehow. It's trying to make me replay a floor twice. So I I can't use my last ticket to fight the boss. Am I ever gonna get some heals? I'm legit dying here. Mm. 
Uh, it's uh, holy shit. It, I click next floor. It goes to 28 again. It's like trying to it's trying to screw me over by making me replay a certain floor twice. So I miss my last chance to to hit the boss. Devs of this game, such trolls. Wait, I, I realized something. I think Owen and Lara have a separate HP bar. I think it might be the case. Because when Owen gets healed, Lara doesn't get healed. I never actually noticed that. Alright. I have one try today. I have one try to try to get some pieces for him. It's gonna be another really long journey because uh, should I run double heal for this? No, I run my strong comp. I mean, I don't need to sustain afterwards. I just need to. I just need to fuck him up. Wait, what if? What if I buff? And then I transform. Do I lose the buffs? No, I still have the buffs. Dang. I, I I don't know exactly how good he's gonna be, but I think he's gonna be really really good. Like his his self-sustained first skill just looks like it's gonna be really OP. I have a prediction that he's gonna be meta. Like once people start uh, getting him, but it's gonna be really really long because you know those TLC pieces they almost never drop oh shit ah fuck ah shit oh wait all right never mind I thought I accidentally clicked it that one that one had daggers I didn't want to I didn't want to use it all up um is there a raid boss if there's no raid boss I do the next PvP fight I, I just wanted to showcase my um should I do it for him all right let's just do it for him uh what's my where's my full physical comp hey what if what if I run Arin instead Yo, what if I run this comp? Wait, is this comp going to be strong without the succubus? I'm just thinking if attack buff is going to be more important than crit buff. I think attack buff might be more important. Alright, let's 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 actually try this out. Let's see if I, I get higher DPS using this comp. Because I was thinking, like, if I run the succubus, I have crit buff. And she also, she's also a damage dealer. But if I can keep attack buff on my team, it's going to be insane. I'm gonna wait for armor break to land. Shit, I forgot to turn on auto. Then I'm gonna pop Owen. She's gonna she's gonna pop the crit buff and also the fi physical damage buff. The boss is only level five though. He's not he's not that strong. On that, some armor breaks. Maybe if I run like three armor breakers or two armor breakers. I, I, I really wish there was a physical damage dealing unit that had crit buff in this game. That would be insane. I only got it to 90 something. It's that good. Maybe I need speed buff, I'm not sure. Yeah, maybe speed buff is better. If I had like a speed buffer, it might actually be better. And Death Knight actually doesn't do anything for my team. Like he's he's really not good for raids. So Took it down by like 50 something percent. It's it's uh, it's okay, I think. Not exactly sure if it's better than the succubus. I think it's it comes very very close. 
All right, let's uh, let's find a full magic comp in the arena, and then I'll show you guys how to counter them. That guy was too strong. All right, he had too many four stars. I I couldn't handle that shit. Uh, right, can I handle this shit? No, wait. I I don't think I can shit either. Let me find. Let me find their stupid double heal comps. What would be better if, is also if they used Ashley. Yeah, like this. Th I think this is this I might be able to win. Like he's he's full magic. He's literally full magic. All right. So the the strength of the Zenith Queen is she counters and she reduces magical damage every single time. So uh. So she's literally just going to be countering, but the, the problem is, she's not very tanky. So I kind of just put in two healers to try to make her survive. What happened last last round was, I wasn't, uh, I think it was just bad RNG, like that R didn't crit enough to boost her bar up to start healing my Zenith Queen before she got her silence off. And she died again before she got her silence off. I'm tilted. Wait, I might be able to win this, if I crit with this. I might kill their whole entire backline. Alright, that didn't happen. I'm, I suck. I, I fucking fuck this game. <laughs> God damn it! All right. When I, I'll raise a third healer and then we'll do this again. All right. I'm gonna run Zenith Queen in the front line. I'm gonna run three healers. All right. It's gonna work. It's gonna work. She's gonna be countering. She's gonna be throwing shit back. I'm gonna have three healers healing her at the same time. All right. All right? God damn it! I think I'm in denial. I might be in denial because I spent the last two weeks farming her. No wait, I, I refuse to admit that I'm that she's bad. She's good, alright, she's a good monster. Two weeks was worth. Um anyways, I think that's pretty much it. That's that's the end of the video, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Um peace out.